You know, one of the first signs that you're on the right track financially is when you can treat yourself to the finer things in life. For some, it's driving that luxury car, shopping for designer outfits, or jetting off to some exotic destination. For me, it's about those unforgettable experiences, like the time I took my daughter to Paris to see Beyonce for my birthday. Yes, Paris, the city of lights, good food, and memories that will last a lifetime. It wasn't just about the concert, although Beyonce did her thing. It was about being able to create those moments with my daughter, something I'll cherish forever. It's a reminder that when you work hard, you deserve to enjoy the spoils of your labor. But let's be real for a second. Financial success isn't just about the material stuff. In fact, 64% of Americans say they'd rather have financial security than indulge in luxury goods, according to a 2003 financial wellness survey. True wealth is about having peace of mind, knowing you've got a safety net in place and that you can provide not just for yourself, but also for the ones you love. You see, building wealth isn't just about the present, it's about ensuring a solid future. And that takes smart money management, investing wisely, and yes, saving even when it's tempting to splurge. Another clear sign you're doing well is when your career and or your business is thriving. Whether you're climbing the corporate ladder, running your own company, or earning a high income doing what you genuinely love, that's a major financial win. It's about waking up every morning and not dreading the workday ahead, but instead feeling inspired and motivated to keep pushing forward. For me, this journey started back when I was working on Wall Street. I realized that my financial success wasn't just about the paycheck. It was about having control over my destiny, making smart investments, and continuously reinvesting in myself. And trust me, nothing feels more liberating than having that kind of freedom. But here's the thing, having a high income is only one piece of the puzzle. A study by Fidelity found that 67% of high earners feel financially insecure because they lack proper financial planning. That's why building an emergency fund and preparing for unexpected expenses is crucial. Financial success isn't just about how much money you make. It's about how you manage what you have and being ready for those life happen moments. And let's talk about family. Being able to provide for your loved ones is one of the biggest indicators that you're killing it financially. Maybe it's sending your kids to a top-notch school, buying a home for your family, or taking care of your aging parents. These are the things that matters most for some. And let me tell you, there's no better feeling than knowing you're in a position to support the people who mean the world to you. But beyond that, it's about having the ability to save for the future, invest in your growth, and give back to your community. It's that full circle moment where you realize your financial journey isn't just about you. It's about building a legacy. Now, here's another sign. When you can spend time with your friends and loved ones without stressing about the cost. Ever felt that little pinch of anxiety when the check comes? Yeah, I've been there too. But as your financial situation improves, those moments become less about the cost and more about the experience. It's like the time I treated my closest friends to a weekend getaway in Miraval. We laughed, made memories, and I didn't have to worry about the bill. Those are the moments that remind you why you work so hard in the first place. Investing in your future is another big one. According to a Gallup survey, only 55% of Americans invest in stock. Meanwhile, those who do are significantly more likely to build long-term wealth. And here's the thing, the earlier you start, the better. It's all about making your money work for you, whether it's real estate, stocks, or that side hustle that turned into a thriving business. Investing is the ultimate sign that you're thinking ahead. For me, this meant branching out into different ventures from real estate to owning multiple businesses because I knew that diversifying was the key to my long-term success. One of the most obvious signs you're doing well financially is a steady increase in your income. Most of us look at our bank account and we worry about how we are going to make ends meet, how we are going to pay for rent or pay for that car note this month. According to a recent survey, 66% of Americans feel like they're living paycheck to paycheck. And don't get it twisted, that's both high income earners and lower income earners. That 66% represents everyone, low and high. So. If you smile every time you open your bank account, you are probably one of the lucky ones who are constantly receiving raises or bonuses at work or have a business that's thriving with positive cash flow. So congratulations, you are on the right track. 
The reality is the amount of money you have in your bank account can be a reflection of your financial health. So the most obvious way you will know if you're doing well financially is the amount of disposable income you have in your bank account. A growing income not only provides more financial freedom, but it also allows you to save and invest more for the future. Another telltale sign that you are doing well financially is having low levels of debt. Are you able to pay off your credit card balances every month? Have you managed to pay off any high interest loans or, block or a line of credits? If so, you're in a great position to build wealth and achieve your financial goals. Low debt levels means less stress and more money to put towards savings and investments. The reality is there are people who don't even think twice about putting an expense on their credit card because they know they will be able to pay it off without hesitation. To be fair, there are people who put money on their credit cards knowing they can't pay it off, but that's not the point here. This is a great luxury to have if you can pay it off because it creates a more stress-free life when money is not a concern. It doesn't mean everyone operates in that manner, some people see himself as more financially frugal. So even if they can afford something, they will be very cost conscious, but it's a great feeling to never have to worry about money. Another good sign of financial health is having an emergency fund. Surprisingly, a recent survey revealed that only 30% of Americans have one, leaving 70% at risk during an emergency. Do you have enough money saved to cover these expenses? Do you have enough money saved for six months of living expense? An emergency fund can act as a safety net for unexpected costs or job loss. It's essential for financial stability and shows that you're ready for life's surprises. Another sign you're doing well financially is when your life feels more spontaneous. This means you aren't bound by a strict schedule. You're no longer waking up at dawn to make it to work on time or staying late because your boss needs you to do something immediately. You can skip the long commutes that often lead you arriving late. Instead, you have the freedom to set your own hours. If you want to push something off for tomorrow, that's your choice. Feeling like sleeping in? That's your choice. You can spend the entire day in bed relaxing and forget about limited vacation days or requesting time off. You call the shots on how much time you take off for yourself. You are in control deciding when you take your break, when you go on vacation, and when you do that deep dive work. The last, and I think the most important sign that you're doing well financially is when you're in a position to give back. That's when you know you've truly made it. Whether it's donating to a cause you are passionate about, volunteering your time, or simply helping out a friend in need, being able to give is a sign that you built a strong financial foundation. And let me tell you, there's no better feeling than knowing you're making a difference in someone else's life. So. There you have it, the real signs that you're killing it financially. Remember, it's not just about the luxuries or the numbers in your bank account. It's about freedom, peace of mind, and the impact you make on the lives of others. As you continue on your journey, celebrate your wins, learn from your setbacks, and keep striving for greatness. Because at the end of the day, financial success is all about building a life that you're proud of. Thanks for tuning in, guys. And remember, your financial journey is uniquely yours. So make it count.